Hey everybody, welcome back to some more CK Tale. Uh, I'm a day late on this stream. Chat might not be as active. They're not used to it being this day, and it's earlier in the day, and it's a Monday. Nobody likes Mondays, but uh, I was busy. Uh, Sora, Kakusi Sora on Twitch was uh, streaming at GDQ, but it's a hotfix, so you have to remote host in, and she used my computer because her computer sucks. So, yay. <laughs> Uh, you just finished episode 20 and you got a notification on live? Okay, well, welcome to what might be episode 200 at this point. Like, genuinely, this might be episode 200. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm pretty sure this will be episode 200. Uh, so, a real quick recap of what I've been thinking about the last week in terms of the game. Is I've been trying to figure out our next move. Either, either than child murder. That is true, chat. I, there will be child murder. Who am I murdering right now? Um, I'm not murdering. Hold on. We don't have uh, a truce, right? No, we already got rid of it. Sweet. Um, we're killing this guy. There we go. Okay, now that we have the most important part out of the way, uh, which is setting up our next murder. So, we have the invasion cast a spell I now, which is, you know, we pick a war goal, but we get everything that we have sieged down when we end the war. So we could potentially take the whole country. But there's two things going on right now that could end our war inconclusively. And they're both very likely to happen. It'll end conclusively if either their civil war ends, which if we're doing a full invasion, it'll probably end during it. Or it'll end uh, if my ruler dies during the war. Now, my ruler is how old? 57 years old, has cancer, and is bedridden. His health is quite poor. Uh, he does have some bonuses to health in here somewhere, I think. And we have the Fountain of Youth, so I can occasionally shave a couple years off. But the fact of the matter is, he is very old and very defenseless at this point. It's quite likely that he's going to die soon. Um, his heir right now, who is also our regent, is only 38, so he's not that old. He doesn't have anything to make him super healthy, but he's not a bad ruler overall. I think he's going to do decently. Uh, we are trying to prestige stack him and everything, and he's part of the Hermetic Society, which is important, so he can use a lot of our equipable items when he rules, which will really bring his stats up. Um, so what I was thinking, because we only get to use the CP once per ruler... I'm going to do a real quick invasion. I'm talking, I just get whatever I get at 100 war score. Uh, I don't try to push for anything extra. I try to do as lightning fast of a war as I can and grab whatever I can, right? And just hope I get something. And if I don't, and if it ends inconclusively, it's not the end of the world. That sucks, but we can handle it. So uh, we're going to try for that. Then we're going to, once our guy dies or we peace out of the war, we're going to try and reassess how their civil war is going, see how close it is to one side or the other going, uh, winning. If one side is about to win, then maybe we'll try and, like, just get them to end that war already. And then when our ruler dies, we'll have our new ruler in, and once the situation is stable, and hopefully their civil war is over so they can't end inconclusively, we do our invasion, try and take every last province we can and try and just mop up the entire Byzantine Empire. After that, you know, give it a few years, uh, build up the land just a little, then we can go get Bohemia back, because we are going to be so strong if we take all of Anatolia. We already have a good chunk of Greece. All right. So, uh, we... Now that we have... We want to look at this, and if I were to invade... We want to pick an area of our, uh, we want to pick an area that is really easy for us to grab up all of for that war score, you know? So I'm kind of thinking we take, we go for Bulgaria, that's easy war score to get, uh, and then all we need is we, we keep everything else that we grab, so we start grabbing other things. Hold on, do they, do they finally actually join a thing against me? Hold on, did they actually? Wow, they actually finally, after all this time, were accepted into a defensive pact against me. Never mind, we can't declare this. Uh, we would have the we'd have the majority of the world against us. Ah, uh, yeah, it says Christian defense pact, but in reality, it's like everyone. So we need to we need to drop our threat more. 
Okay, well, by the time we drop the threat more, we are doing statecraft. By the time we drop the threat more, more people might have left this defensive pact. Oh, hey, uh, almost 2,000 free dollars. Man, that sucks. After so many easy wars of us picking on them. Okay. Our goals then are we need to keep enough money on hand that we can get this extra slot in our capital if we can. We need to build up the hospitals around the capital a little bit more so that we have more protection. Uh, so that we have more protection from disease because we do know the plague is hitting China and it will eventually spread east. So it is just a smart idea. Check your special projects. Right, we have great works that we could be putting features on, don't we? Yep, we don't have a feature going on the gardens. We have Grand Mausoleums going, the gardens, and Andromeda's Rock has a few more slots. Okay, let's start working with that. That's fine. We'll die soon anyway. Um, and we'll get the new ruler and we can start really picking things up from there. That's fine with me. Uh, we don't really desperately need any of these. Because a lot of these are just local, aren't they? Like, morale of armies is not going to be global, will it? Because if it was global, that'd be nice. But I think it's local. Um, I mean, we could get spikes just for the execute prisoners thing just because that's kind of cool monthly prestige i really don't care about uh yeah none of those are that important to me right now let's look at here the ba the bahai gardens still have stuff that i'm pretty interested in uh poet opinion is lame gardener opinion is lame private conversations we can already do but i wouldn't I'm not going to argue with getting more fertility. That's not a bad idea. Although we do pay a lot of money in having a large family. Whatever. Plot power defense is never a bad idea, considering how many people clearly want to kill us. Um, private conversation and send alcohol gifts. Do we have send alcohol gifts available? I don't know if we do. Dynasty opinion's not bad. Child opinion, not bad. Uh... Okay, there's a few things there that I like. Are we able to send local gifts right now if I just pick a random guy? Alcohol gift? No! Okay. I think that's what we want next year then, is alcohol gift, just because it's a it's a good diplomatic thing. Yeah, and drunkard opinion up, which isn't going to happen that often, but whatever. Okay, we've got that feature building. All right. Ooh. Hold on, a bunch of people are leaving the defensive pact. I think it's because we dropped below 95? Yes. So we just dropped below 95. Uh, with over 95, you're considered threatening enough that even your own religious head and, and, and holy orders from your religious groups will defend the other defensive pacts. Now that we drop below that, was that what's going to boot them out? Because a lot of big names are dropping out of the defensive pact now. Maybe we can do this war. Let's just see. How much did this number fall apart? Okay. I think there are less crests. We just need to give it a little bit of time. It looks like a bunch of people are dropping out of the defensive pact against us. All right, we're attempting our murder. Oh yeah. Yeah, lots of people are dropping out. Reputation, people know I'm trying to murder. How much did you miss? Uh, it's okay, you only missed like nothing. Okay, I'm gonna split this army and have some up here. Just cause I'm gonna wanna eat up a lot of this land quite quickly. And split this as well. Because we're going to be hitting a lot of places at the same time when this war goes through. Boom. Killed the guy. Got the trade posts. Okay. Next most is this guy. Oh, I can send alcohol gifts as I have a brewery. Well, I'll be able to send double alcohol gifts. Or more likely, it'll do nothing. Whatever. Uh, defensive pact opposing... Oh, the Holy Roman Emperor. That's fine. That's not related to us. <laughs> Call my court physician. What is this? Uh, I eat on the moon. Has awful joint pain. One of our sons. Sure. Oh, we've got a peasant revolt. Where are we looking? Right there? That's tiny. Yeah, I just raised my local levy to take care of it. 
Don't even need a commander on that. Oh, looks like my vassal's taking care of it, actually. Medical Academy in Constantinople. Hey, we died! Yay! Okay, we don't need to worry about that anymore. Okay, let me just, before I read this, I just want to make sure that we didn't lose anything in the transfer of power. It's looking good, looking good, looking good. Because we have a lot of good loot in the treasury. I love the treasury mechanic. Our old ruler was awesome, don't get me wrong, but, uh, you know, he was bedridden. We wanted a new ruler. Everyone's pressing F in the chat. Cancer, right? Yeah, he had cancer. He hung on for about a year with it, but, you know. Grand Prince Frost Silver Whisper. I believe his nickname was the Sword of God. Sword of the Lord. God, that's good. Grand Prince Frost Silver Whisper has ascended to heaven at the age of 58. He died of cancer. Guilty of the sin of pride, he wanted everyone to know his greatness. A wicked man. Frost Silver Whisper will surely pay for his sins in the afterlife. What the fuck are you talking about? This guy was the Sword of the Lord. He was... Okay, well, his murder count was over 100, I think, right? He had 67 kills. We had more than that last episode. I think they miscounted. Grand Prince Tverdoslav, Tserdoslav, maybe. Having mastered many skills is sure to be admired by his subjects. Long live Grand Prince Tserdoslav. Okay, and that disbanded the defensive pact, I think. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. Let's uh let's let's get this all right. Oh, hold on. We honor the dead. Uh he's dead. Let's decide on how to honor him. Yeah, I can invite all the people to pay homage to him in a grandiose ceremony for 400 gold. Yeah, that clearly didn't scale. That cost like nothing. Yeah, just 400 gold, that's like nothing. Okay, a new defensive pact has been formed though, okay. This is gonna say it'd be pretty ridiculous if they just gave up on having a defensive pact against me. Tech spread, I wouldn't mind that actually, yeah. Our money is really good now. Okay. You didn't get murdering bloodline because you can only forge one, right? Yeah. Uh, so first of all, let's disallow us from leading the army. Uh, let's choose an ambition... Gruminair. And business focus, because I really want to get that... Uh, really want to get that extra holding slot. Marshall, this guy has cancer. Do I want him leading? He's a flanker, though. I do like flankers. Can I grab someone better from outside of the country right now? And grab someone who's a bit equal. And he has skills that I'm less interested in. We'll take him. 24 is really good. Yep, that's our best. That's our mum, isn't it? Our aunt. Okay. 21 is pretty good. We can get 22, but this guy's stressed. We'll just take this guy. And also bribe him. There you go. And, no, our wife is actually pretty good. Immediately drink from the Fountain of Youth. That shaves off two years. Write a theorem paper right away because I obviously want esoteric knowledge to climb the ranks. Um, how far are we in society? We're only level one in society. That sucks. Okay. Um, we need to double check that it gave us the correct equipment because it doesn't always give us the same stuff as our parent when it comes to what's equipped. Um, these are all pretty good so far. Yeah, these are pretty good so far. So far, it's got our best stuff equipped, yeah. God, we have some high quality gear. Okay, yeah, we've got our best stuff equipped, which really jacked up our skill. That's awesome. Love the CK2 vids, been watching since February, that's awesome. Okay. Uh, and is the defensive act against us, like, is is he just not in one? We do need to lower the levy now, right? Yeah, that war is about to end. Our, our vassal's taking care of it. Okay, they have no defensive pact against me right now. 
They might get invited to another one if... Because I am still very threatening. I think they would get invited to another one if I wasn't quick enough. So I'm going to claim Bulgaria immediately. Boom. Okay. And right, his civil war isn't about to end, right? Yeah, their civil war is still fairly inconclusive. It's invasion time, everybody. We're going to try and scoop up every last thing we can. Now that we're not going to immediately keel over dead, we're going to keep going until it looks like their war is about to end. So we need to keep tabs on it. Did we die of cancer? Yes, we haven't unpaused yet since dying of cancer a few minutes ago. We're, we just need to wait on our new marshal too, but you know. Can't put a price on heirlooms? What is this? Uh, this is for Magnum Opus and Stellar Astrology. Do not get rid of that. I'm willing to pay the money to keep that. Get that Italy boot. That's a bit low priority for me right now. Let's get the war score first so that we can end it when we need to. Mm, no, do not remove those things from the treasury. I can use those later. Uh, domain too big. That's okay. I don't really have anything I want to give away right now. Praise the Lord. What is this? Uh, honor the dead. Ah, yes. Oh, rest in peace in the Grand Mausoleum. That's cool, but the Grand Mausoleum's not done being built yet, but okay. Those who hate him might not be pleased. Well, fuck them. Here we go. That's that's the guy we want to make our marshal. Perfect. How good is the wife? She's decent. Good with money. That's all I care about right now. Alright. I kind of want to knock that guy out. Is he just marching to... There. Okay. Peasant revolt ended. Yeah, my guy took care of it. Uh, he's just going to keep running. That's part of the revolt. Whatever. I'm going to leave him alone then. Okay, easy victory up here. We're going to be running at a little bit of a lower game speed than usual just because I have to manage four armies, although they're all in the same area. Actually, you know what? I have a retinue army down here who could eat up a little bit of land, couldn't they? Although it's mostly revolt down here, and I don't think I'd be taking anything from the revolt. Yeah, I wouldn't. You know what I can do, though, is take some islands. Let's do that. We need a fleet down here. Come on, where do we have some boats I can actually raise? Really? Just that? Okay. Well, we'll have to roll with that then. We'll do two trips. Okay, yeah, things up there are looking good right now. Wife has been overcome with fatigue. Call the physician. Split this army and embark it. Here's some China. Done reaping terrible harvest in uh, China. Ah, the plague has finally stopped in China. They've returned to stability. I'm also getting a promotion in my place. There we go. Good. The money's going to start flowing again. Perfect. Also, we should send an, a eunuch and a concubine. Uh, this is just some kinsman. I don't know why he even wants them, but there you go. I don't need them. And concubine is just our kinswoman. Yeah, send her, whatever. Yeah, we didn't get hit by the plague. We got lucky. Okay, here we go. March in the army. Holy Roman Emperor, are they at war with them as well? They are? Hmm, the war is, that war is about to end too. You need more of your bloodline. Uh, we have a decent amount, but I would like more. There we go. We got promoted in the Hermetic Society. And I'm going to get these guys over to that island. Bark. Okay. Things up there are going well. Okay. We can siege down the uh, islands there. This will give us a little bit more of a navy in the Mediterranean. 
Oh, right, I have some vassal fleets up. That's fine, I'll put them down soon. And we're all good up here, yeah. Just making sure no one's, like, sneaking up there. I would really like more siege experts. Can we get some more right now? I never remember which way you spell it, but it looks like neither is available. Nope, can't get anything. Damn. And are there any within the country that I could grab right now? Because we are low on commanders. Actually, King of Croatia is not a bad commander. We'll put him on just as a general commander. Not looking like any siege experts that would have any actual skill. Oh, we do not have good people to pick from. Okay. Okay. Keep rolling with this then. Okay, he's on the island. And we'll just go put down that fleet for now. When do we get the uh, CK2 Christmas music? I think it's in December that that starts. I do really like the CK2 Christmas music. Oh, our wife just died of pneumonia. Great. Okay, we need a new one. Who's good with money? We can get better than that. Come on. Want uh, women? Diplo range? Yes. Married? No. Who's good with money? You're 60. You're 31, but you're gay. Um, 50, 50, 17. Ah, oh, she's a Buddhist. Huh, she must be, I think she's Indian. Yeah. Well, if she's in Diplo range, sure. Will you marry me? Uh, probably not. God, I hate when it does that. Where it's like off screen. There we go. Is it because I'm a heathen? Will not consider from infidels. Okay, most people won't. So let's do my religion. 